This Our crime. thoughts should now turn conference. away from the Tsarnaev brothers for good and remain with those who will live in our memories forever. Crystal Marie Campbell, Martin Richard, Sean Collier, and Lingzi Liu. Our thoughts and prayers should also be with the 17 brave individuals who lost limbs during the marathon bombing and all the other victims and survivors who still cope with injury, with loss, and are still healing, as well as our hearts should be with this great city of Boston. After two years on investigating this case and 12 weeks of trial, it is time to turn the page in this chapter. I want to briefly acknowledge the hard work and commitment of the investigators, the prosecutors, and the victim witness advocates in this case, in particular, Assistant U.S. Attorneys William Weinreb, Al Shakravardi, Nadine Pellegrini, and Steve Mellon. Anyone who has watched their work over the last two years knows that the United States has not been better represented. Their commitment, not only in the courtroom, but to the victims and survivors themselves has been incredible. I also want to thank all of my law enforcement partners, local, state, and federal agencies, in particular the FBI, who along with the JTTF, as well as Boston Police Department, Massachusetts State Police, Watertown, and MIT Police, worked tirelessly from the very beginning to find those who were responsible for these heinous crimes and to assist in holding them accountable. I have never been prouder to be a part of such a dedicated group of law enforcement officials.